I have been searching for this one keyboard. No, it's not just a keyboard. A waffle iron which could make waffles in the shape of keyboards. Originally launched on Kickstarter in 2015, the keyboard waffle iron was a limited run novelty item, which made it impossible to find the thing because it was always sold out. You could, however, get it on the aftermarket, but not without paying absurd prices for it. Avoiding the aftermarket, I pursued on and continued my search finding it. And suddenly, a second sale of the keyboard waffle iron popped out seemingly out of nowhere and it sold out. But that second round didn't bring the aftermarket prices down, and so I decided enough is enough and I finally bought the iron. Alright guys, it has finally arrived. The keyboard waffle iron, or at least I hope. Oh, it's here. Oh my god, it has arrived. Oh my god! Oh my, why am I so excited for a waffle iron? I mean, it's literally just making waffles, right? Now my end goal with this is to make a keyboard out of the waffle. I mean, that's the whole point of having a keyboard waffle iron, right? But first, we gotta actually make the waffle itself. Uh, as you guys know, I am a chef, uh, actually really good chef. Throughout my career, I've actually cooked for many people. Obama, Mr. Beast, that one food network guy with the funky hair. Uh, some people that I've not cooked for yet, but I am going to. I even got my own cooking show, you know, Cooking with the Cooks. And I even have my very own apron, which as the saying goes, a dirty apron is a good chef. And so, cooking a waffle can't be that hard, right? So the first thing we gotta do is to preheat the pan because as per instructions, it said preheat the pan while making the ingredients. So we got a pan on the plate. Run. <laughs> Manscaped. Hi guys, it is me, Manscaped Man. I am once again here to show you Manscaped's PP. PP standing for Performance Package. With this, you'll be getting Manscaped's Lawnmower 4.0 and a bunch of other things. I personally use the Lawnmower 4.0 as part of my daily routine, and that thing is amazing. And thanks to Manscaped's skin safe technology, you can't even cut yourself using it. Trust me, I've I've tried. Manscaped also has the new oh, Manscaped also has the new boxes 2.0. They come in many different styles, which not only makes you look good, but also makes you feel even better. Get your PP today at manscaped.com and use code SQUASHY for 20% off your PP and free international shipping when you purchase your own PP. Once again, that's code SQUASHY for 20% off. I'm gonna go pull on my shirt now. So yeah, we got all the ingredients, we got the pancake mix, and yes, it's pancake mix, but waffle mix is actually the same as pancake mix, so we're just gonna use pancake. We got a pretty good egg, oil, so yeah, we'll be first making the pancake. Now, like I said, I've actually cooked many things in my life, but I've actually never cooked pancakes before. Or waffles in this case. So I didn't really know what's going on. <laughs> Bro, what, what's going on? But after mixing it together and following the instructions literally on the box, we managed to make the pancake mix. All right, and we're done with the pancake batter. I mean, it's pretty good, you know, consistency is there. All right, so we are actually done preheating the waffle. I've also made the batter three quarters of a cup because that's how much they said to put into the waffle. We actually have the waffle preheating. I, have, I haven't oiled it. Ooh, I haven't oiled it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? Ooh, wait, I forgot to oil it. Oh, just use your forehead grease. <laughs> <laughs> so right here we're sponsored with my natural forehead grease and <laughs> I'm a professional chef, so I'm not, ah, I'm not scared of oil. <laughs> Alright. Oiling this thing. And in goes the cup of batter. It's so thick. <laughs> the batter is in the pan. And right now, I'm gonna sit close. Alright! I'm a chef. Whoa. It smells good. Yeah, it smells good. It smells hella bussin. Oh, I'm I'm a millennial, you know. I am like 12. Hold on, let me get a fire extinguisher. Oh, four or five. Alright, it is time to flip. And Ooh. professional chef. Okay, All right, so it's been four minutes on each side, and now we're gonna see the final product. I'm gonna turn off the fire because we had a mini accident. Big review, grand review, unboxing time. The keyboard waffle iron final product. Three, two, one. Whoa! Ew. Damn! Whoa! Ayo, that's cool. Alright guys, so here right now we're reviewing the brand new Waffle 65. Uh, we're gonna do a typing test. Sounds like hella cat. Ooh, hella pocky. So it's time to put the maple syrup and serve. Ew. 
Yo. Alright, this is really good. This is the best waffle I've ever eaten. And it's not because I made it. But it is. At first I thought this was probably one of my stupidest things I've bought. But I think it actually is pretty cool. Is it $130 cool? Arguably. So it was actually so good that my sister decided to make her own. But if you can't tell, I don't really like my sister. So I decided to add a special ingredient for her, you know, especially for her waffle. This is payback for that one time she took my phone. The dumbest still ate a waffle, she didn't even know why I hit yeah. her, man. Boom, look at that. Boom! So we're done making a waffle and we actually made a pretty good waffle. But can we put a keyboard into this? See, I don't know why I thought I could put a keyboard into this, because the size of the waffle is actually smaller than the usual keyboard. So a PCB couldn't even fit onto the keyboard. So unfortunately, I couldn't even make a working keyboard with this, but I did, however, put the switches on, which somehow fit. See, I tried putting keycaps on these, but the keycaps are way too close. They kind of like cramped up. But here's a sound test of what a waffle keyboard would have sound like. Sadly, we couldn't do it this time. Okay, I'm sorry, but why does a waffle sound better than my keyboard? So yeah, the keyboard didn't turn out as I wanted it to, and this video was a mistake.